This video will show two animations of matrix transformations. The animations are from the Interactive Linear Algebra textbook shown below. I also have the license, as well as a link to the full text, and a link to the specific section. For a quick review, given an M by N matrix A, the matrix transformation associated with matrix A is T of vector X equals matrix A times vector X, which is equal to some output vector B. So we can think of the transformation as a matrix function where the inputs and outputs are vectors. And the transformation is from Rn to Rm, where notice N is the number of columns in matrix A, and M is the number of rows. So let's take a look at the first animation. Here we are given a two by three matrix, shown here in black, and then we have times the input vector, vector x, equals, in red, the output vector, vector b. Because matrix A is a two by three matrix, this is a transformation from R3 to R2, which means the domain is R3 and the codomain is R2. As we animate the vector x, the input vector, we can see the corresponding output vector, vector b in red. So if we pause here for a moment, we can say the output vector b is an image of vector x under t. We can also say for every output vector b, vector x is the pre-image. Also notice while the codomain is r2, the actual range is just the purple line because notice how under this transformation, all the vectors b fall on the purple line in r2. And now let's take a look at a second example. Here matrix A is a three by two matrix shown in black. And then we have times the vector X in green equals the output vector in red, vector B. Notice because matrix A is a three by two matrix now, the domain is R2 and the codomain is R3. And again, as we animate the vector X, we can see the corresponding output vector, vector B on the right. So a couple things to notice here. Again, we say the vector B is the image of the vector X under T, and the input vector X is called the pre-image. Notice the range, or the set of vectors B, fall on the plane in R3, so the plane is the range, and the codomain is all of R3. I hope these animations give you a better feel for matrix transformations.